Apparently there was going to be a thunderstorm later today in Eugene, but one thing was certain, Stanford's Alana Vodder was ice cold today, pitching a complete game shutout. Meanwhile, Stanford's offense just kept pouring on runs, giving them a 5-0 victory in the series finale. Stanford took control early with an Eleni Sparakis solo home run that just bounced off the foul pole to take a first inning lead against starter McKenna Clythermus. Montana Dixon then rocks one to center field for a two-run blast in the second inning. Alana Vodder reminded everyone why she's among the best pitchers in the conference by tossing a gem. After allowing two hits in the first inning, Vodder only allowed two base runners over the final six innings of action. Stanford added some extra runs on an Emily Young single in the fifth and then a throwing error in the top of the seventh to make it 5-0. Alana Vodder's final line was seven innings pitched, three hits, zero walks, and six Ks. Head coach Melissa Lombardi talked about how the Pac-12 schedule leaves no room for error. I think in this league, anytime you get opportunity and you, you get momentum, you have to take it. And when you don't take it, then you're going to be on the wrong side of it. Oregon ends up splitting the series with Stanford this weekend. This drops their overall record to 30 and 10 and their conference record to eight and seven. The Ducks will try to follow the sun next weekend down to Tempe with a matchup against Arizona State. From Jane Sanders Stadium with Duck TV Sports, I'm Michael Strike.